We are here in Schiedam in the Five Sluizer Haven. We have installed Catchy River Waste Collection System. Catchy consists of a floating structure, a cage inside the structure, and two floating booms. One of 200 meter and one of 12 meter. The waste is pushed by the wind and the currents inside the cage. Once it is in the cage, a non-return door prevents the waste from going out again. The floating system is secured with piles, so it can move up and down with the tide. What is unique about Catchy is that it catches litter on the surface, but also below the surface. It catches macro and microplastics. The microplastics are harmful for fish and other animals because they confuse them with food. Right here in the new Maas River, Catchy prevents the litter from flowing into the North Sea. And it also prevents the litter from entering that natural area where birds, fish and seals come to feed and rest. The collection cage is lifted out of the frame once a month. We'll do an inspection and then we'll place an empty cage back into the system. We take the cage with the waste to the lab and there we sort and analyze the litter. We are at the, the boys' yard, it's all sea's yard in Rotterdam. And we are with the cage of Catchy, which has been brought for uh, emptying. So today we do what we call the sort of pre-sorting. So my colleague is in the cage and he's picking up all the big objects by hand. We separate in different categories and then we will weigh them. The idea of separating the waste is to get more insight in the composition of the waste that we collect. How much is biomass, for example, that is naturally transported by the river and how much is the rest of the litter, so plastic, metal, glass, processed wood, paper. So once we have finished this pre-sorting, we uh, will dispose the biomass after weighing it and then other categories of uh, litter we will perform a more in-depth analysis in our lab. The work we do here in the lab takes about two days. It is a very uh, thorough analysis and everything is done by hand. Here we are looking at the different types of objects that we collect. So is it plastic bottles, bottle caps, lids, cigarette butts, straws? The idea of such uh, an analysis is to be able to track the source of the pollution. With that information we can go back to, for example, governments and they can decide to take action for the implementation of new regulations to prevent that sort of litter to end up on the streets or in the river. We are quite satisfied with the way uh, Catchy works. The system is very effective with uh, high tide and with low tide. The litter stays in the cage, even if the wind or the current comes from behind the cage. Every day we work at sea and we witness the plastic pollution. We encounter plastic on the seabed. We recover fishing nets, even far away from the coast. We are committed to solve this problem and to provide solutions to prevent our plastic from flowing into the oceans. What makes me especially happy about this project is to see the enthusiasm from all kinds of people, from the client, from companies, from within all seas. Also people that didn't know about the project are now becoming more and more aware and taking initiatives to minimize the litter ending up in rivers. This is only the start. We want to make a difference on a global scale. We want to install many more systems and come up with new solutions to solve this problem. Apart from the technology, we want to create more awareness for the enormous amounts of plastic flowing into our ocean every year. This is a huge problem. We need everyone in the world to contribute to a cleaner environment.